Good Tuesday morning, everyone. Christian here. Um, today we have school again. Uh, but luckily next week, which is Friday, June... June 6th? Tri Friday, June 6th, school is over. What's up, everyone? It's David from CMD Vlogs slash the Christian and David Show. Um, today, our topic is... If you if you know what if you like follow soccer and all this, the new <coughs> Nike Magista and the new Nike Superfly. Let's also talk about the World Cup. Good idea. But first, we're gonna start out between the Nike Magista and the Nike Superfly. The Nike Magista comes in three, as right now, that's all we know, three types. The Opus, the Onda. The Opus, the Abra, and the Onda. Onda. The Obra is the original one, which is like the Nike soft like <coughs> Um that's the original. Second one is the Opus, where it looks like a normal cleat with a Magista design. And the third one is the Onda, which is an indoor soccer boot. The Magista is made for wider feet, True. unlike its okay. Nike competitor, the Superfly, which is made uh, in the Mercurial line for narrower feet. Um, which one you would you recommend for yourself? For me, I would choose the Magista simply because I have wider feet and I'm not much of a striker, more of a playmaker. I would choose the um, Superfly because I have not, I don't have wide feet and I <clears throat> am a striker, so I, that relates to me a little bit more. So. And the Superfly does come in two kinds, the uh, sock-like one and the uh, normal boot one. Yeah. So next, we're gonna talk about the world. Wait, are, are we not finished talking about them though? Don't you wanna share some thoughts about what you think though? Uh, I do think that it's a cool idea to have a sock-like boot, but you know, I haven't tried them yet. I I want to try them. I I don't want to make anyone mad or anything, but I think that the Magista looks ugly, unlike the competitor, the Superfly. I think the Superfly looks better than the um. Magista. Oh, both of them are equipped with Nike's uh, technology. It's called Flyknit. Um, I don't know what that is, but that's what well, it's I, I feel the Magista is just. That's their thing. The Superfly, I feel, is just more of <clears throat> so. But we cannot really truly say which one's better without trying them. We should try to get them. Like, we should save up a little. Um, next World Cup, top World five for you. Who's going to win second, third, fourth, and fifth? First, Brazil. Second, Argentina. Third, um, maybe maybe Germany. Fourth, Italy, and fifth, Netherlands. How about how about instead of um? No, no you already said it. Fine. You can't change it. All right. So for me, my top five are Brazil because they replaced all their old players with newer and younger players that are good. Uh, second would be Spain, so Brazil, Spain. Third would be Germany. Fourth would be Netherlands. And fifth would be, I'm gonna go with, did I say Netherlands? Yeah. All right, for number five, I'm gonna go with Argentina. You already said Argentina. I did. Oh. I'm gonna go with Argentina. All right, so there we go. Um, Let's see, who, uh, definitely England, I don't think are going to win. They just do not have the kind of I mean, skill. Rooney, everyone thinks Rain, Wayne Rooney is like, oh, I'm Wayne Rooney on the best, but he's not, like, that good. Like, I can't really, I don't feel like he's good. Um, and France, the thing about them is they have good players. It's just I don't think they work together. You know what I mean? I think it's like... I have to score the goal, I'm not passing, and it doesn't matter if I get tackled or whatever. I just have to score, not you. All right. I think that's what France's deal is. I they do have good players, but they need to communicate and play as a team, not individually. I especially like Brazil's formation, because they're like just spread out everywhere, so yeah. you can just... Alright guys, yeah. this has been the Christian... Oh, you want to... No. Alright, this has been the Christian and David Show. That's David, I'm Christian. Don't forget to watch the vlogs. Woo! Alright guys, if you like the Christian and David show, be sure to stick around every Tuesday for new episodes. 
So I'm going to end it here. The, the Christian Dave show is always pretty long, so I like to not vlog a lot. Just the Christian Dave show. If you enjoyed this installment, be sure to like and subscribe. I'm Christian, and I'm going to see you guys all later.